Okay, let's see. Stream seems to be up. Audio seems to be okay. I'm gonna switch to this. Yeah, everything looks good. Let's switch this to live chat and this to live chat. Okay, camera. Okay, I think we're good. Yep. Welcome to a new session of Seven Days to Die. We have to do some farming and some, you know, honey hunting. That's going to be the first item of business. We are doing this session on a Saturday evening again because, frankly, the last few weeks have been very busy, you know, both socially and in work. A lot of stuff. So that's why we're doing the Seven Days to Die stream here. Hello, too late for you. Welcome to the stream. But yeah, finally we have a couple hours allocated to going back into the zombie apocalypse and shooting some zombies in the face. So I'm just gonna start. Bellwolf says, at the pizza joint. What's up? We're gonna shoot some zombies. We're gonna get some stuff. Also, get some good pizza. None of that anathema thing with the, you know, pineapple on top. Because that... Is not pizza. That is sin. Okay. Was doing some work here. You will see. The moon project is moving forward. Uh, guys from the advanced propulsion project. I've been working here. This is the vessel under construction, you see? Hello, Greg. How are you? You're relaxing? Awesome. This is the beginning of the construction of the vessel. Do you see? We got this crane that once the vessel is done, it's going to lift it up, put it here in the launch pad. And we're going to go to the moon to investigate the gravitational anomaly that's causing the earthquakes and all the weird stuff. So yeah, the project is moving forward. And as you can see, I added a couple of uh, cosmetic things over here. So this crane looks looks good, you know. Uh, I just edited the XML. I posted on the Discord the, the, the new recipe so you could add this. So you mean you cheated again, you compulsively cheating monster. No, Gladys, I did not cheat. I added a few XML cosmetic recipes, so it looks good. Let me just show you over here. Because as you can see, this is from the launch pad. So the ship is being built there. And this, this goes up. Grabs that, put it here, puts it here, and then zoop, we go and we go into the moon. Uh, also, I've been working over here. As you can see, we need to harvest that uh, corn over there. So we're going to be momentarily over going over there. We're going to punch the out of it. Because that's how you harvest crops. You punch it. And you yell at it when you're doing it. This is the current state of the, like, the launch area. Like, launch. As you can see, we're gonna, I need to add some lights over here. This is where we're going to have movie nights. You got some books. You got like this pool table. There's a couple of sofas. We got some pictures. This is the 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 the, the, the like the cat photo bombing the the very fancy picture of the dog. Hello, yellow tiger. Got an old town over here. We got uh, people can come over here get snacks, a little bit of coffee. You see, it's not the cafeteria slash mess hall that's on the second floor over there. This is for people to relax. And on the second floor, we're going to build like uh, like the living quarters for the crew that spends time here at the Sky City. Because as you, you know, the Zombie Research Initiative is uh, operating across this entire region. So we got several outposts. We got field teams constantly moving in and out. And all the operations are, um, you know, coordinated from this base. Start, start. See you out. 
Exactly, Mike. Exactly. It's the best way to maximize our coverage and, and, and looting and uh, zombie control. Because zombies are a real threat in great numbers. Okay. Oh, and I need to do some inventory management because I was working over here. So as you can see, I had a lot of stuff. Greg says, do you have a moon rover or something else to travel fast with? The low gravity would make it hard to use the usual vehicle in ZRI. No, we're just gonna we're just gonna use the you know the, the vessel, the moon vessel we're building. You'll see, don't worry, don't worry. Huh? Uh, we, we, we've been putting some thought into it. Stop trying to sound like you understand what you are talking about, you credit taking monster. Shut up, Gladys! Okay. I'm gonna harvest this super corn by the usual method of punching the out of it. Because any farmer can tell you that this is the preferred method for harvesting crops. You just walk up to the crop and you start swinging. You see? Like that. This is how you harvest. Also, I probably should be swinging with gloves. Because this corn is slightly radioactive. There you go. See, you're just punching. And if you if you saw it on the Discord, and if you're not a member of the Discord, I encourage you to um, follow the Discord. We would call it like a micro social network. You know, it's a place where we can hang out. We, we check out the nerdy things. We talk about news and the games and Seven Days to Die and other stuff. I posted that the first at uh, the first instance of like a big rain here, I would start building uh, or preparing to build the Bat Cave. And I don't know if you can see the light coming from this side of my face. Hello, Indestructible. It's freaking sunlight. It was supposed to rain all day today, and it's freaking sunlight coming in through the window. So, you weather. Okay, we're gonna keep punching the crops. As I said, the first order of the business is um, we need to get more money, of course. As I show you the the, the beginning of the power module that's being built for the for the moon vessel. You see, it's over there, being built behind that crane. So. Um, we need money. We need money. We need parts. In fact, we're going on a long-range scan after we do this. I want to see if there is, if there are more resources, like on the far edges of the map. Um, but first, we need to sell this. We need to sell all of this. And um, in order to get a good deal, we need Grandpa's awesome sauce. The problem with Grandpa's awesome sauce is that it requires honey, and I'm out of, you know, honey. And also, if you wanna, since we move our clocks back, now, if you uh, type exclamation mark time, you can see um, the proper time where I live. Hello, Andre. Welcome to the stream. Uh, how many do we have? 77. Okay, let's start just putting this. And, uh, well, and also, I always, when, when there is a live stream, I always put it on the Discord. There's a section that's called Events, where you can check and it automatically... And um, if you set your time zone in the Discord, it automatically tells you when it will be. Res, uh, says, typing on my phone is not worth it when the risk for mistakes and other correct are so high all the time. Correct. Autocorrect 
developing, um, you know, like its own a mine of its own. But it's good. Okay. We're just doing all of these activities while people notice that the stream has started and start converging because I know this is not the usual time for the stream and we had the uh, we move our clocks back now, come on Siri get over here so the schedule needs a little bit of time to uh, acknowledge uh, you know you acknowledge the changes Okay, We're, I'm gonna need like more of these seats. Um, let's make like 30 more. Then we're going to do some inventory management, which is one of the main reasons why people watch this channel. And then we're gonna go looking for honey so we can make grandpa's awesome sauce. I'm gonna have to check if I have like one grandpa's awesome sauce left. I think not. Okay, so 16. Um, I'm thinking we're gonna be nine shy. I did a quick calculation. Let's see if I was right. Okay, Siri, can you like move over here, please? Thank you. Super corn, definitely the best effort to yield ratio thing in the game to get uh, big amounts. Oh, I got, I was short four of money. See, so you put it here, a couple of days later, you get like a hundred K worth of, um, you know, of uh, crops. Grab all of this, okay. How are we with food? We're a little bit peckish. It's almost 11 a.m. I haven't had had breakfast yet. So I'm thinking we're going to have... Do we have some... I'm gonna have a tuna fish gravy toast. Delicious and moist. Okay, we're good here. Let's just go and drop this stuff. Like all of this. Was I making something? No. 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 Good. So get ready for some inventory management. Inventory management is one of the main reasons why people watch this channel. So the inventory management must be followed. Okay, that's good. This is just that. Everything else goes here, like this one, this one, this one, that one, this one, that one, that one. I need to scrap some cars as well. Yeah. Okay, let's put this over here, which is this is where the finished products go. And there's no point in us running around with a paintbrush if we're not going to use said paintbrush. I topped up my ammo before uh, I started the stream. Hello, Kayleen. You have not missed anything. I was just harvesting the corn, the super corn up there. Also, I showed over here the beginning. Now, now we're serious about the construction of the moon vessel. Like the propulsion unit is ready over here or, it's, or close to ready. And the, once the vessel is done, the, 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 the crane is going to take it, put it over here in the launch pad, and then we're going to just zoom over to the moon. The vessel over there, the prototype for that engine was tested over here, you see. Greg says, we have a Brazilian watching and typing in Portuguese. Yes, I said hello, isn't Greg? And we go over here because we need to do a little bit of... Oh, before we do that, easy, wow. That was close, that was close. 
Do we have a Grandpa's Awesome Sauce? No, we don't. We got six jars of honey. Interesting. Hey, James. In theory, we could make a Grandpa's Awesome Sauce. I think it takes four. Let's see. Grandpa's Awesome Sauce. We got the money, we got the jars of honey, we need some evil fungi and super corn. Okay, let me just grab a little bit of evil fungi. And I need four. One, two, three, four. Okay. And I think we need to do it down. We're still going to go and punch a few a few trees. Do I have the, the thing that gives me chance to get honey from trees or not? Let me just quickly make this. Turn on. Oh. This is not done here. Must be done in the... I, I thought for some reason that it was done there. You need to cook it. We're gonna cook it. There you go. James Emma says, JC, have you played around with the game Planet Crafter? No, I don't know that one. Is it about crafting planets? Recipes. Grandpa's awesome sauce. We're gonna track it. Grandpa's awesome salt. We're gonna cook it. It takes four minutes. Okay. So in the meantime, let's just go and store the honey back here. The honey is stored back here because it is akin to, you know, like a medicine. It, it cures infection. That's why it's not stored here with the rest of the beverages. Okay, in the meantime, let's take a look and see if I have that book. Terraforming game with lots of inventory management. Nope, never heard of it. Where is the book that allows you... Must be main, maybe in Lucky Looter. Find more dukes, find more ammunition, find more brass, lead, junk, food, medical supplies. No, this is not the one. Wasteland treasures, maybe? Look at this. Odd adds a small chance to harvest honey from trees. We have that one. We read that one. In theory, if we go on a, on a tree chopping spree, we could get honey. Okay, they dropped that over there. And Greg says, hello, Adred. How are you in Brazil? And uh, he tried a tentative translation on Google. Yes, we're going right after the airdrop. Like I said, I've been to Brazil, like, I don't know, in my entire life, like 20 times. I like Brazil. They get good food. Nice people. Very hot, though. Hot and humid. Does it work for trees in the burnt biome? I'm gonna say probably not, because the trees in the burnt biome, what they give you is... Um, they give you coal. Okay. I'm gonna get rid of this rock. There you go. Okay, it's dropping. Let's just drop this over here. Okay, what do we have? Let's see. Got a scope mod. Some antibiotics. Those are good. Okay. Let's open this one. 
Oh, nice. We got a lot of ammo. That is good. Got a couple of books. And these books we already read. And this is a level action rifle um, quality 3. Eh, not bad. Not that good, but not bad. Okay. Let's see if I can go on a... Um, you know, like... Login spree. Let's see what we can get. James Herman says, yes, it does. Was very surprised to get one. Okay, so we have confirmation that indeed the trees in the burn biome can sometimes give you the honey. I don't know what chance it is. It's probably pretty low. As you, as you can see, I've been running around chopping things and nothing. This is mostly pine. I'm going to re do some reforestation because even if it is the zombie apocalypse, it is important that we replenish our natural resources as we go along, you know, harvesting them. Hey, Paul is here. Hello. Rick says, I would like the devs to have the ability to grab the drops with a, a mod hook attachment to the helicopter for while catching the package before it lands. Interesting twist. Mid air maneuvers. That would be pretty cool, but it would in it would like definitely encourage more creative flying and possibly people pressing E, uh, like it happened a couple of streams ago and me plunging, you know, to the ground. Ha 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 ha! That was funny. Shut up, Gladys. Hello, Peggy. You're watching your song's video posted both yours and his into the Discord. Yours is not correct, not like yesterday, which was backwards. Weird. Remember that we have in the Discord a, a place where you can post your videos so people can watch them when they have, you know, if they were looking around for something to watch. We're thinking of a passive function for the hook. Yeah, but that's not very exciting, you know? Best if you have to, you like, do a flip. And then you go like, whoa, while you're doing it. The magic E button gives you get a great ride, yes. So, well, you see, uh, I've... I've uh, felled, like, I don't know, over 10 trees and nothing. So... Let's go back to the new main facility of the Zombie Research Initiative. Grab the... Um, Grandpa's Awesome Sauce. And maybe we grab the engine of the... Oh, look at this. I'm seeing immediately upon takeoff, I saw Street Stomp. I need maybe the engine of destruction. Vegas says, I am now on day 56 of the 100 day project. See, where every day you craft a thing. Okay, let's go over here. Stealing the loot from other survivors or stopping the loot from falling into a giant horde of found dead? Well, sadly, giant hordes of found dead. Other than during Horde Nights are not feasible. And in Horde Nights we get the Walters. So. Okay, let's go to the Sky City. Drop the things we have. And then we're going to go to that town over there, to the south. We're going to start selling to Trader Jen. There's another trader over there. Then we're going to fly to that one over there. We're going to try to do it hard and fast. So we can use the benefits of the grandpa's awesome sauce. 
to the top. There you go. Boop. There you go. Boink. Sounds like it's still good. We do have mods on it too. Oh, knock, knock yourself out, man. There's an airdrop to your southwest. Oh. Let me check that. Weapons and traps. Put that over there. To the southwest. Past videos are proof of it. Uh, of what? I, I don't do mods. There was a smoke if you look back. Ah, oh, well. It will be there. Southwest. Okay, let me just grab the grandpa's awesome sauce and get ready for some serious, uh, you know, trading. There you go. Grandpa's awesome sauce acquired. And we have the corn and we got these things. Also, we're not going to have that. Oh, also, if, uh, like I said on the um, on the Discord in the morning, my iPad is dead. Uh, it won't it won't hold charge anymore. So I ordered a Samsung uh, Galaxy Tab um, A9, which was on a promotion, very good price. Should be delivered during this afternoon. So if I at some point I start screaming in panic and I told you to just wait for a little bit and I put the like the um, the intermission scream on is because my tablet arrived. So don't panic. Nothing's wrong. It's just you know like the uh, according to the tracking it will be delivered between. 3.20, <clears throat> I believe it said, and 9 p.m. That's the delivery range. So, uh, you know, so I don't know. It, it could be, it could be good. Just try this. And weapons and traps. Yeah. There's anything that we can... This thing. This thing goes over there. This thing goes there. I'm going to repair this one. And yeah, probably we can... Can we sell something that we have here? With some traps. I'm going to try to make the most of... We're not going to sell the Mathilde, of course. We're not going to sell that. We could sell this uh, Tactical Assault Rifle level 5. So we can get some good money. Fortifying grip, not this one, maybe. Uh, this one. This one. That one. This one. That's probably enough. So this one over here, we're gonna not. We're gonna modify. Add this one. Okay, sorry, that was for clothing. Okay, 2600, pretty good. And this one we're gonna modify, we're gonna add that one, that one, this one, and that one. Wow, a lot of money. Okay, let's just put it there, put it there. Anything else that we need to... This level six compound bow could be also a good thing to sell. I'm gonna repair it. What else do we have for compound bow? We got this strength. Possibly not that, not that. We get this. We get this. Ooh, I think that might be it. Let's just do this. Modify. Put that one over there, that one over there. Okay, the other one not. This one. Modify. There you go. Look at this. 3,800. We're getting ready for a selling spree 
the likes of which the zombie apocalypse has rarely seen. Okay, let's go. Let's go. We're gonna head over to Trader's Gen compound, which is like in that direction. I think I'm seeing the top of it. And then we will see. Greg says, we stop it and wait for later. Prefer not to mess with the flow of the story during the story too much. Okay. Paul says, last couple of weeks I managed to watch all six seasons of Young Sheldon. I really liked it. I... Uh, is that show still going? Or is it over? It's been a while since I heard about that show. I really need to sit down, possibly tonight, and watch Oppenheimer, which drop on HBO Max. Uh, or Max, actually, is called right now. And also I need to watch the Marvels on Disney+, Plus, which I noticed was available. And Echo, which I have not watched. Three Body Problem was pretty good on Netflix. Anybody is thinking about watching that one? Pretty good. Okay, get ready. It's about to get heavy. Okay, Trader Jen. You're looking kind of rough. You didn't get bit, did you? Ha 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 ha. That was funny. Shut up, Gladys. I'm gonna drink this. And I'm gonna drink this. Okay. Sell. 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 Not interested. Okay, can we buy something interesting from you? I need this. Uh, cooler. Not what I need. Mm, no. No. Pass fast. Come on, move fast. You got a grandpa sauce on sauce at 80... F uh, okay, I'm gonna buy it. It's a good, it's a good thing. You don't have anything else? Nothing. Now that okay. was a good deal. Yes, I know. It was a good deal. Oh, we need to watch... Uh, yeah, I need to watch X-Men 97 also. Yeah, I forgot about that. Uh, I need to watch X-Men 97. One more season on Young Sheldon than his brother George is getting a spin-off? Wow, a spin-off of a spin-off. Crazy. Okay, we got two minutes of selling proficiency. So I'm heading straight for the other trader's compound. You can see it in the distance. I was getting cable. A1 Auto. There's a big ass tree in the middle of the street there. Which is faster, hot or cold? Hot, because you can catch a cold. That was the pond section of the uh, of the stream. Okay, okay. Come on, come on. We got one minute and thirteen seconds. There you go. Trader Hugh, close the door. I don't want I don't want any undesirable zombies appearing over here. Hey, bro. <clears throat> Sell. Sell. Okay, nice. Look at this. Got over 50,000 buckaroos. What else do you have? Hello, Michael. Mm, trying to see. I need an ammunition box to store the medicines. It has, I think, a higher capacity. No, this is not what I need. 
duct tape, pen. This is actually pretty good. Duct tape is is an essential resource. Yeah, we were selling the we were selling the irradiated corn, you know, the super corn, and it is good in terms of like yield when you apply also grandpa's awesome sauce okay i think that's it i guess you're not so bad after all thanks you don't think you've ever seen an ammo box for sale i had in previous alphas i don't know about this one maybe they removed it Who knows? Okay, we're out of Grandpa's out of awesome sauce effect. So let's just go back quickly to the new main facility of the zombie research initiative. The Sky City. Drop this stuff. And then we're flying over to... No, we're going to take the engine of destruction. And we, we're going to ride. You know, we're not going to fly. We're going to ride. Indestructible says, is it craftable? Nope. James says, might have to do the EML thing, the XML thing. But you know, every time I add a ref recipe uh, to the XML, like uh, the one I added over here, I'm going to show you the crane and the new lunar vessel that's being built. Uh, I added like the hook to the crane. This is really nice. But Gladys insists that, uh, you know, I'm, I'm cheating again just because I edited the XML and added a cosmetic. Stop trying to sound like you understand what you are talking about, you credit-taking monster. Well, at least you didn't tell me I cheated again. Okay, say, so tell, tell your son, uh, Paul, happy birthday from me, you know? This is his 16th birthday. Okay, 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 look at this. Auto rotate, auto rotate. Woohoo! Oh, Jesus Christ. Ha 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 ha. That was funny. This is Star Star, Seattle. out. Seattle, Cash TOT 16. What do you mean medical expenses, you stupid accountant? Okay, there was a miscalculation. You know, I dismounted over there and um, there was a miscalculation. Luckily, I did. I survived with 42 health left. What happens if I use one of these? Does it cure the leg? No. Well, if anybody was uh, waiting for, um, you know, like leg breaking, it happened. It happened. Yeah, the engine of destruction is over there. Let me just, uh, you know, fix my broken legs. Because I fell from over 100 meters in the air. <sighs> okay, I can, you know sacrifice a little bit of health to go fast yes i know i know i'm looking at the health it's important to keep an eye on that so we don't die stupid there's some damage there when the zombies go does siri not have a cast Siri's inventory is at present time empty i i cleaned it up before Embarking on this on this ride. Okay. Yeah, I know it hurts. Don't worry. I have a cast here. We're gonna need a cast. We're gonna need some juice. Okay. Hello, Mr. Payne. Okay. 
I'm gonna get a couple of those in case we need to juice up, you know? And maybe one of this. And one of those. Yeah, we're good. And actually, I'm gonna get a few more of these so we can use them. Okay, take two. Now, first order of business. Let's just put all the money we made there. You see? We got 64,000 buckaroos. Nice. Let's put this new grandpa's awesome sauce we have over here. Let's put... In case. You mean when? We put this there. Uh, oh, since we're here, we're going to do the bar stool. You see, when people are just playing here, there's a couple of stools around so anybody can sit and watch. And I'm going to save these others for other builds. We put it there. How long has it been since Toy had a book hunting spree? What? Let's go over here. You had a bug hunting spree. Um, I don't, I don't know. A while. I've read most of the books and maxed most of the abilities, so. Autocorrect struct again. Autocorrect is a harsh mistress. Yeah, there's no, no really point and look at, because if you look at this, um, look at this seven out of seven automatic weapon handbook four out of three but don't give a rat's ass batter up craft chain modification for clefts. Mm. This one could be good. Bar brawling, we don't do the farm and the great heist. Mm. 7 out of 7, 6 out of 7, 7 out of 7, 9 stalker I don't use, pistol pit. Shotgun messiah, 7 out of 7. Sniper, 7 out of 7. Urban combat, 5 out of 7. Tech junkie, 7 out of 7. Waste on treasure, 7 out of 7. We're currently working here on perception. Uh, were we working on perception or were we working here on strength? Uh, bomb sticks. Yeah, we were working on strength. We need one more point for this for beast mode. And then three more for Olympic champion. And then one more for the maximum level of the bomb stick. Okay. Okay. But let's not deviate from the plan. The plan was to drive around looking for tree stumps and the um like the the honeybee i mean the honey not the honeybee it says i would like to see another search for new books if possible have some fun hunting disease don't worry we will have those but for now i'm looking oh crap i'm looking for I'm looking for tree stumps because the, 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 the important need now is the ability to make more grandpa's awesome sauce so we can get more money to buy the more expensive components of the ship. The traders, okay, we got over here. Good. Traders are always happy to help for a price. Okay, we did not get anything there. What else do we have here? And also... I'm gonna start heading north, you know? Start heading north. As Steve says, the shotgun of... Damn! Exactly. 
Have you seen loot respawn turn off? Forgot what the setting is for loot respawn. No, no, I, we have loot respawn uh, respawn actually in three days. It's one of the settings that you see like in the first screens. But um, what is this? But um, since we are very high level spawning of magazines i'm not exactly sure how it works oh look at that we have a i just got the the smoke from another and there's a couple of tree stumps nearby so we're going good uh read it drink it keep it open and open a couple of explosive magazines that we read and the other ones i read them the engine of destruction is at 18 health well that means it you know can take a few a few more hits Re remember that our policy enforced by the guys from accounting got a honey yeah, I know. It's to make everything, every duke last as much as possible. Okay, I thought we may get lucky and get... But we got uh, one honey, that's good. I think we got two more back at the base. One additional honey. We can make another uh, grandpa's awesome sauce. I think I'm seeing the thing now. Yep, is it is indeed another tree stump. No honey this time. It's another tree stump over there. Or at least what I think is a tree stump. Do you have the book for honey from trees? Yes, yes I do. But I felt like 15 trees and nothing happened, so... I guess probability is pretty, pretty low. Oh, look at this, an interloper. Down. Oh, she's still up. There she is, down. Okay, no more honey, I guess. Okay, let's keep riding north. Because the other thing I wanted to do during the stream is search for any other resource sites that we have not yet identified to the north of the map. And you remember which book number is, is, yes, it is, one second. It is this one, check this out. My senses have picked up something. Yeah, it's a lady. It's no longer a lady. Uh, is this one, um, no. Predicted type of stroke again. Yes. Which was the great lucky? Look, I. Th uh, no. Uh, great heist. No. Oh look at this! There's a t do ten percent more damage to bears. That could be good. Uh, where was the thing for uh, the honey? I saw it. Ammunition bracelet, medical supplies and loot. No. 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 Automatic weapons handbook, butter up. Great heist. No. We just saw it. And retrieve temper some more arrows, shotguns, spear hunter, urban comeback, tech junkie. This one Wasteland Treasures. Wasteland Treasures number one adds a small chance to harvest honey from trees. Red. 
Yes, it is Wasteland Treasures. And we have it. Oh, another tree stump. No honey. I wonder if we kill Wilson, we will get honey. It's probably the damn, damn ass, the, the dumbass. Yeah, we have all the wasteland treasures. Probably the dumbass uh, uh, bear is carrying around some honey for his personal use. Okay, I'm gonna drop that and I'm gonna drop this. Hey Siri, where are you? How may I assist you? Yeah, I'm gonna give you some stuff so you can carry it and not, you know, like clutter my inventory. Yeah, I don't know, no, no, I know. Oh, look at that chicken. I know bears don't carry around the, the honey. It would be, you know, like, good. Like, it would give us a reason to go and actively engage with Wilson. Because right now, I prefer to stay as far away as possible from that psychotic bear. It's a pine forest. Hello, Isaac. Welcome to the stream. Okay, we're heading north. There's some sort of medical facility over here. What is this? I don't think I've seen this. Okay, I'm going to explore this. I'm going cinematic. Mercy Point Camp. Okay, there's it's half a lady over here. The there's a jackass over there. We hear feet. Hey, there's a rabbit over there. Hello? <laughs> Nurses are supposed to help people. Not try to bite them. I got a lot of wanted and missing people. The crap. Oh, this one this guy was pooping. It was a zombelina? Okay, this guy pooped so hard, busted the toilet. Hey human blaze the cat. How are you? Well, at least we got like one magazine bar brawling. Drinking beer no longer blurs your vision. Nice! And your bus lasts twice as long. This is a good find. Now we're gonna be able to chug up like the beer and everything. Nice! This is embarrassing. Your actions bring shame to the entirety of the zombie research initiative, you embarrassing monster. Shut up, boys. Uh, I'm gonna pick this. Yeah, it's gonna be a double whammy. Master, we are not alone. I've never seen this. This lady is missing uh, a shoe. Keep hearing feet all over the place. Careful. 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 Oh! Look at this! This guy was cooking inside here. Bro, you were cooking. What the hell? Mm. 
There's a Scully over there. Hello? Got a lot of angry zombies. Okay, are you gonna open the door or should I just? Uh, a zombo tanning booth. I says, just celebrated two years of marriage with the wife yesterday. Awesome. Awesome. Congratulations. Okay, this lady lost like her head. Shut up. Okay, we go up. Okay, I think we might have cleared up most of the dangers. Yeah, this looks like the main loot. Okay, I'm back. What do we have here? We got some spears, which no one uses. Anybody uses spears? Like, for, for real. Use this. Scrap that. I'm gonna keep the splint, it might come in handy. Scrap that. Uh okay, Siri. All systems go. How may I help? Yeah, you're going to grab that book, this book, that book, all of those books. Mm, give me the honey. Okay, so we got two honey. In theory, now we're able to uh, oh, chicken ration. This one. I'm gonna scrap this. And I'm gonna eat this. Some cat food, delicious and moist. I hope nobody loses their <laughs> because I scrapped, like, uh, that thing. Okay, we're good. We got two jars of honey. We got two more back at the base. So we can make another, um,. Another grandpa's awesome sauce. Where do you get a water tank? Look at this. It's actually a cool design. I gotta remember it. Up. Oh. Up. Oh, uh, yeah, I need to juice up. Sorry. Okay, there. I juiced up because I was still a little bit injured okay nice place nice place you know this was like uh, what was the name of this place mercy point camp this could actually be like a thumbnail let me just see if we do something like this mercy point camp could be a cool thumbnail um what's going on there getting kind of late I noticed that we spend most of the day with the shenanigans. But the, our mission is clear. We're heading north. We need to explore the boundaries of the map. I think that was a snake. Not exactly sure. But it might have been a snake. I don't know if they got tree stumps in this wasteland area. Incoming enemies, prepare for conflict. Yeah, it was a zombie. I don't give a rat's ass about zombies. Easy. Okay, there's a trader here. Which I don't know if we had. You see, he died with dignity. And the dignity is gone. Yeah, don't know, this is uh, within a POI. I... You loot, I shoot. Traitor Hugh. Uh, I never noticed that that was his motto. You shoot, you loot, I, I shoot. Gonna purchase something. 
Yes, bro, I am. Also, you can tell, you know, it is common knowledge within the ZRI that the traders are in fact of alien origin. Look at Trader Hugh. Uh, Trader Hugh. Look at look at look at his eye. He apparently somehow sustained some damage here. How I don't know how because they have the impenetrable shield. We have not been able to even just like, detect that technology. But he sustained some damage. You can see the alien eye there. You see. It's like. This part of your disguise got damaged. You can see he's an alien. Trust me on that one. Okay, what do we have here? Small pipes. We got a cooler, but I don't need a cooler. The head and the skin are one. Just look at the scar. Yeah, yeah. Aliens or Terminator? No, they are aliens. They are aliens. I don't know what a Terminator is. They use limb technology. That sounds like some sort of interdimensional technology developed by some sort of weird corporation in an alternate reality. But I'm going to say yes, Fred. I'm going to say yes. That could probably lead to a lot of... Alrighty then, on your way. Weird anomalies. Look at this, you see? Isa says, limb or lint? Look at this. You can see the alien eye. What force could be so strong as to do damage considering they have like an impenetrable shielding in this area maybe that trader went outside of the compound and somehow the the shielding does not operate outside of the border okay we got a wilson from the Olympic Exclusion Zone. That sounds like some anomaly from a different reality, yes. I'm gonna shoot this Wilson over here. Just because he's over there. Hey, Wilson! Master, we are not you wanna dance? Huh? We danced. I'm gonna harvest your ass. Is there an official ZRI logo besides the letters? No, just the letters. We need to have something that is craftable within the game. Perhaps the shield operate like Dune Shield. Slow moving objects made it through. Uh, I don't know. I've it could be if you remember in in previous occasions we've actually we hit a a trader with a sledgehammer and the trader fainted but i've tried that in later alphas and it doesn't work so maybe they adjusted their technology but that could explain why at some point we hit a trader with a sledgehammer and this trader you know, fainted. I didn't think it was going to work, but then I hit it and it went down like a sack of potatoes. Lego Fortnite will be getting black and brown bears soon. Lego Fortnite, oh. I've got a bad feeling about this. Yeah, me too. I saw Walter rising from the ashes over there. And there's probably a snake here. Hey, don't bite me, you stupid thing. Hey, you died dramatically. You see, you're driving around, there's a snake, and it bites you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use one of this. 
Also, I had no idea there was a Lego Fortnite. Excuse you, get a Pepto Bismol or something, you jackass. Is that Walter hovering? Look at that. That damn Walter is just hovering in midair. Probably the Walter caught like an, uh, a, a, a draft of air that's going up and it's hovering. I've, I've seen seagulls do that, but not stupid zombie uh, Walters. Hello, Ian. How are you? I was just looking at a hovering Walter here in the wasteland, you see? Probably caught like an off-draft updraft current and it's just now it's not maybe he's sleeping i don't know if uh, undead vultures sleep actually you gotta remember these are animals infected and totally corrupted by the zombie virus Whatever it was, he is no longer doing it because he got shot in the face. Definitely sleeping now, yes. No struggle, only dreams. Okay, we're heading over here in the meantime. Everything seems pretty standard. Our survey has gone to this area, so we're still a couple of maybe a one kilometer sound of the border of what we've charted. But since I did that with the gyrocopter, when you're flying, particularly in this biome, you do not get a good view sometimes Incoming of what enemies, for conflict. of what's you know like hidden under the mist. There was a doggo over there but i am in no mood to engage with said doggo oh i saw something there no it's just a car shut up okay try not to hit every single one of the oh something blew up over there military base here port bags it is actually pretty dangerous apparently Yeah, Mike, I'm, I'm still a little bit in shock because stuff blew up. Bike at 3% or probably destroyed. Ah, it's at 2%, still operational. There was not potato aim, it was panicky steak aim. Okay, I'm just gonna use this. I used to be an adventurer like you until my legs got blown off. I'm gonna apply one of these as well. Get shook! Yes. Okay, that should be enough. Captain Dan! Says Bill. Oh, look at the. Uh oh. Uh-oh, we are in big doo-doo. Things keep blowing up. Look at the amount of burning zombies. You see, this machine over here was just pushing the bodies to the pit for 
you know, combustion. But apparently they got overrun. This seems to have been not too long ago. Interesting. I wonder if there are still military forces from this reality active. Do you have a backup plan if the engine of destruction goes boom? Uh, cry in the shower? That's always a backup plan. Panic and run around in circles. Always doable. Come on. Eh, potato seeds. There's nothing else good here. This is damned for eternal suffering in this universe. We'll probably walk the long Mars road. This escape cannot be made. Master, we are not alone. What the hell is there an underground area? Okay, we're going cinematic. Not cinematic. So. Okay. Eh, we always survive, you know. The book that allows you to walk over landmines without stepping them off doesn't apply to vehicles. Yeah, squishy. Uh, Mike, I'm entering some sort of underground military facility, okay? Seems to be a lot of activity here. Like, this could also be a, a thumbnail. There, you see? Oh, it took some damage. Gladys, tell us the, that JC is working hard for the ZRI today. Negative. Apparently I'm not. It's a message that says, you got this. Thank you. Let's just reload a little bit. Someone is just like, giggling. You sense Voltec's shadowy hand in all this. Oh, the Voltec Corporation, yeah. I know about them. We've encountered them in different realities. We've encountered information about them. They used to build nuclear shelters. Working stiff. Gladys is tough as nail. Ah, uh, she's a snail. Let's say that. You are a monster. Oh, shut up, Gladys. Okay, I don't have any lockpicks, right? Gonna open this. Let's see what we can find. This appears to be like the main loot area. This is a four red skulls, two orange skulls POI. So definitely extremely dangerous. Oh, look at this, a level six ton baton. A wheel. Another wheel. Oop water. I'll read that just for the XP. A lot of ball crap around. What is this? Weird. They were Building a, an escape tunnel or something? I thought this underground part was going to be bigger.
I have my... Hey lady, charge my stick! Okay. Let's enter this tent. I've got a bad feeling about this. Electrifying! Don't forget about the chest down there before you leave. The good stuff is in there. What chest? I opened the chest. This one? Shocking performance. Something blew up up there. But this one? No. If it's that one, yeah, we got it. I actually need one of those. There are... It could be really good if I could just, like, buy one of those chests. And interlopers. Dumbass. Shooting you in the nethers. These things are resilient. Okay, dead. You were two minutes behind? It's okay, it's okay. I always appreciate... What the hell? You're getting explosions. I always appreciate, you know, people... Oh, look at the moon. It's, it's definitely looking bigger. I think the gravitational anomaly is starting to increase. We're gonna have to... Oh, bubble boy. Perhaps sniper rifle is in order. I need to do some testing because I'm using this as my sniper, you know? It has the ability to shoot like this. But I really don't know how more, much more powerful a sniper, which I believe is the, is the marksman one, would be. I think I have a level 6 marksman. Okay, my yeah, we got several... We got several mines around. Okay, we got another skill point. Any wandering blasters? Um, I don't know. Yeah, I have not seen any wandering blasters. No blasters, Gladi. I think they only show up during. Uh, Fortnite. No damage uh, far off range will be better. More economically efficient uh, per bullet. Um, huh? Much more damage. Need to say. Memory serves a sniper and have a full auto mod added to it. You maybe could. Yes, Andre. Thank you for being in the stream. Thank you. Okay, we were doing this. Beast mode. Three more and we unlock the Olympic champion. And I'm also going to start putting points in heavy armor. Because my stamina is just... Bad. Look at this. You see? It's operational. Okay, let's see what we can do over here. You live in Minas Gerais? I've never been there. I've been to Rio. I've been to Sao Paulo. I've been to... Um, uh, what was the name? Uh, Joinville. I've been to several areas. Well, Buzios, of course. If you have full demo expert, you can still pick up mines. Uh, who knows? Maybe. One second. Let me just do a little bit of... Cigar should help saving you three points of strength. Yeah, but it smells bad. You know, I don't want the friggin' base smelling like zero. Elvis says, have you ever been in Munich? Nope. Nope. In Europe... Let me just check something over here. Uh, what was that one? F demo. 
Demo. Uh, let's see. Mm. Demolition expert is a thing in... Okay, if infiltrator, for instance, can pick up landmines. Yes, it's the infiltrator that can pick up landmines. Take 50% less damage from last... Stop blowing up. What was I talking about? Oh, yeah, in Europe, I've been... Great to see you, master. In Spain, Italy, Scotland, England, Ireland, dumbass zombies over there, France, Poland, Monaco. Yes, hello, Alex. Gibraltar. Never been to, to Germany. The one in the seven days to die, especially awful now about the smell. Yeah, it's, 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 it's cigarette smells like. I'm gonna fix my. Okay, the bike is fixed. Let's keep heading north. It is the middle of the night. It is incredibly dangerous. What we're doing. I hear this the screeching of water. Uh, the stupid zombie Walter screaming into the night. Oh, also, I'm back. Hey, get some Pepto Bismol. Everybody has like tummy problems over here because mostly because they consume dead people. My bike killed him. Well, it was a good use of the damage then. What the crap was that? So weird. These are weird parts to be around in the mountain. James Herman says, when is the next Lego build? The next Lego build will be the Batcave explosion for effect. That Game Master Team Seaholm Sunby, which is a massive build, it's gonna take us like, I don't know, six, seven sessions, maybe more. It's like 4,000, uh, you know, pieces, maybe 10 sessions. And I said that as soon as we had the first proper big rain, I would start preparing. Oh crap, oh crap! Radiation zone, radiation zone! Master, we are not alone. I know, I know, we are in a radiation zone, it's deadly. Okay. We have discovered a deadly radiation zone. And the thing is now, the sun is shining outside, so... No such luck yet. Okay, that was bad. That was bad. There's a radiation zone up there. Deadly radiation zone. Not survivable with our current equipment. I'm heading west. That dog just slapped me as I drove by. I wanna I wanna really quickly check if there is anything of interest here. But yeah, we got a deadly radiation zone there. I see a house. hear the screeches of the walters on in the night easy easy stop screaming and following me you stupid zombie bird okay easy Apply bandits. More Walters! Oh, crap. Stop! 
Stop! No. You're wandering around over here and all you see is the screams in the night. And actually that's going to be the title of this episode. Screams in the night. There's a crawler over here. I'm actually going to just edit the title right now. Oh crap. Bubble boy! Bubble boy! I'm trying to edit the title, if you will excuse me. Screams in the night. Screams in the night. Yeah, I heard you. I'm editing the title, you damn thing! Also, I shot... There was... Apparently, there was a mine, and I shot the mine. My bike's on fire? Where's my bike, by the way? Master, we are not alone. Uh. Uh oh. Uh. Start, start, see you out. Uh, Mike. Yeah, I have an issue. See Cast T O T six two. Yeah. I think my engine of destruction just blew up. Yeah, I, I don't care about the cost of the thing. I care about the fact that I'm in the middle of... I'm in the middle of the wasteland. Right next to the damn... Oh crap, this is going to be bad. Call AAA, quick! Yeah, maybe roadside assistance can... Yeah, that, that mine I shot was indeed my bike. I was not aware of the fact that vehicles could explode. Run. Call Uber. Yes. This is very interesting, you know, data. Because, like I said, I was not aware that vehicles could explode. Hellish jog down the wasteland, yes. That was a painful loss. Yeah, the zombies were like, roar! Okay, you wanna dance? Yeah, you trip! Oh, no, he went to eat the snake! Okay. Would be atomization, annihilation, or simply automotive uh, troubles. All of those. Yeah, we had a lot of stuff in there as well. And now, it's gone. Oh. What? I'm swimming. Oh, look at this. It was a thing. Commands the running around in circles screaming. Yes. R now I'm um, now I'm actually just uh, vaporized. Yes, the insurance wants work. Well, actually, I wanna I want work with the insurance. I I need to file a claim or something. Okay, so the second part of the stream is going to be the frantic running in the woods back. To the new main facility of the zombie research initiative escaping the bubble boys also i'm going cinematic reality basis just joined what's going on bro well i went to the north of the map got stopped by this irradiated era then as i was fighting zombies my motorcycle exploded so now i'm just going all the way back to my base on foot we're gonna be doing some crying in the shower once we get back to the sky city yes what comes first sunrise or no ammo well if there is no ammo we always have the stick you see we got the electric bugaloo stick in fact i will demonstrate this immediately yes in the older office running and shooting in the woods at night check this out charge my stick 
<laughs> Electrifying! Okay, anybody else? Who wants to charge my stick? Also, it's kind of... I hear voices. This place is always being haunted. We need dramatic action to escape music for the return. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh Walter! Jesus. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna conserve ammo. We still have a lot of ammo. It's good. Electrify! Talk to my stick. Come on, bro. Talk to my stick. Apply bandage. Walter, I don't want you charging my stick. A stunning performance. See you, you stupid zombie bird. I will drink one of this. And I will put this over there. Screw you! You're barely charging my stick, bro. Not a lot of charging action on that one. Oh, look at this, there's more water. Huh? Been a while since we did the... Uh, a, a water... Uh, you know... A water segment. And the good thing is that this... Wilson may not be chargeable. No, if we, if we come across a Wilson, I'm gonna just start blasting his face. He's a stupid zombie bear. Water facings looks better. Yeah, we have not really, you know, like, tested a lot of the water physics in this alpha. Like, I did some testing early on when we were first starting to build the Sky City, but... My senses have picked up something. Nothing ever since. Let me just hit this guy a little bit more. There you go. Siri, what is it that you go. have? How may I help? Okay, you got bacon and eggs, which I will get. I'm going to put that over there. I'm going to put this over there. Still no word on a gyro, I guess. No, we have a gyro. It's just that we wanted to take the engine of destruction over here. And it blew up. The mighty Cthulhu base was magnificent. Yes. I haven't spoken to Cthulhu things since the last alpha. I'm gonna shoot you in the ass. Might as well try to make contact, you know. I'm gonna make a note of that. Might have been away for a while since version 16-ish, I think. Well, a lot has happened. A lot has happened. We got a gyro. I tend to, for some reason, jump in mid-air out of the gyrocopter and crush my legs. There's some claims uh, not corroborated by me that my potato aim in panic shooting, I shot the bike and it blew up. Yeah, just stick around for like, I don't know, 20 minutes or something that's going to take me to go back to my base and you will see the state of the game. Because I got a gyrocopter and I have a giant ass city in the sky and I have walters and everything is electrifying. Okay, I'm running. I'm running. David says, hello, I am from Nepal. Oh, hello, David. Welcome to the stream. Uh oh, bad doggos, bad doggos. Tie fighter doggo. Okay, excuse me. I, I saw something to my left. I think there's a Walter. Hello, Brandon. Yeah, we got a Walter. There it is. Okay, if you're coming for me, you're gonna get not a very good welcome. Okay, I think we, we're getting a... You can fly around. Remember, there was a mod on the copter. Didn't know it was added into the game. Yeah, we got the gyrocopter now. Good jar. Okay, we're good. We're good. Come on, come on. You can do this. Gather 
gather your stamina. Okay, we got this guy. Come on. Electrifying. What's your mission today? Survive. We're going back to the facility. After blowing the engine of destruction up. Oh, thank you for the like. Remember, if you don't like the video, the almighty YouTube algorithm says this guy is what we call the hate watch. The act of watching and not liking. Okay, I'm running. I'm running. I have a perk that during combat we do not consume stamina. But it lasts for like a little bit. Out of combat, we consume stamina, and there's a Walter following me. You see? Right over there. Doggo. High five for Doggo. Yeah, the engine of destruction blew up. There was a battle here. It caught fire. Some reports indicate I had the potato aim in shooting it. And it went kaboom. Stake all the way. Agree, Michael. Agree. We were talking about stake aim. So we've been running for the, you know, for the past, like, three hours in the nighttime across the haunted ass woods. Do you have the book where you can sneak sprint for free? Then you can just duck and run for everything. I think I don't. They were fighting in a retreat and being chased by very persistent zombies and walters. Siri, please clear the line of fire. There we go. Yeah, we're gonna say that shooting it and blowing it up, getting chewed on by the counting was all part of the plan. Imagine like the... Do not blow up Siri. Yeah, don't, don't blow up Siri. That thing didn't even charge my stick. I suffer another abrasion. Healing weak. I need a vitamin. Uh, what do we have? I'm gonna eat this. I'm gonna drink this. My senses have picked up something. I'm gonna shoot this guy. I always shoot them in the nethers. The hell that broke loose without you singing. They made you shoot your vehicle. It was. Like I said, some people say that I shot it, that will require a third party confirmation. I'm gonna repair this one. But yeah, it, it, it blew up. Oh crap! Bad doggo! Okay, I'm gonna apply one of this. Uh, Siri. Do you. Siri! Siri. It is a pleasure to serve. It was Gladys. She controlled the bullet. That, that's probably going to be like the official stories. Warning. We have a problem. What? What problem? You are a monster. Oh, shut up, Gladys. Okay, we're making our way back to the base. Your armor is weak, not yourself. Oh, my armor. So there's, we took some damage. Okay, okay. Jesus! There is a condition that you can get that's cured by vitamins. Shoot them in the nether, so always. You think I'll watch a video when you found the object in the desert outside the research initiative building. Yeah, we found the gate of... That we, it was actually us sending it back in time from Alpha 16. 
Okay, so what part of the armor is busted? Well, everything is kind of busted. I think this one. Can we repair that one? And I'm gonna repair this one. Yeah, good old times when we had access to Nequadria, which is the most powerful energy source in the known universe. Okay, I be better go on the road. Just that thing blew up. Master, we are not alone. Uh oh. Bubble boy! Okay, I'm running. Jesus. Come on, come on! Okay, I ran out of 765 millimeter. We got some shells. And we got the electrifying stick. Okay, anybody wants to tango? Okay, this guy wants to tango. Bro, come on! Electric youth! Come on! Charge my stick. You did not charge my stick. I will not give you a good review. Because the stick was not charged. Steam says... It did not blow up, you mistakenly blew it up. Well, like I said, we will require independent third-party confirmation of this, you know, narrative that has emerged that I blew up my own engine of destruction by mistake while I was panically shooting at everything. Okay, I think we're good. There you go, you stupid Walter. Yep, someone blew up over there. My hey! Charge my stick! Good. Where are we? Oh, we're good. It was a nice shot, yeah, thank you. We are out of the wasteland, so... I'm gonna come back because, like I said, we're out of the like most dangerous part. You think Gladys has access to artillery, JC? A lot of explosions in your general area. Maybe. Maybe, who knows? Getting darker outside. I'm gonna. One second. I'm gonna lower the intensity of the light here a little bit. There. Bill says third parties have reviewed the footage. One speed and confirm a slippy trigger finger. I have prepared a declaration which I will read at this point. Charge my stick! Thank you for your um, understanding. At least I have a charge stick. There you go. You just got a secret shot, you monster. Oh, thank you, Callum. You survived. For now. Much appreciated. It allows us to buy the nerdy things. Like. As I was saying at the start of the stream, my iPad died, so I bought a Samsung Galaxy Tab A9, which could be delivered at any second, so we gotta be, keep an eye on that. Wonder what that location was from the place your engine of destruction exploded. Eh? Uh, it, could, it made for good content, yes. Thank you, Callum. It's a league with Gladys. No, Gladys, Gladys used to uh, tell us. The explosion was here, you see, in this area. Like, over here it blew up. Because there's a deadly radiation area there. So I was driving around here, then over there, then we stopped over there, and then just blew up. Good thing is that it's 3.03 a.m. And we are rapidly approaching 
the um, the Sky City, which actually I'm gonna mark a quick point over here, 1.4 kilometers away from the Sky City. In fact, we should be able, as you can see, dawn is coming. We should be able to start seeing the Sky City. Oh, look at this Bambi in the distance. Okay, Bambi, stop jumping in that direction. Once we get a clear view of the area, you will see the Sky City. The current facility of the Zombie Research Initiative here in the Alpha 21 world. David says, where can we download this game? This game is available on Steam. If you have access to the Steam um, game store, you install it. And usually it can be, particularly when there's a sale, it can be purchased really, really cheap. I've seen it for like $3. So yeah, it is available on Steam. And I am not aware that it is available for PC anywhere else. I've got a bad feeling about this. And there are plans for updated Xbox and PS4 versions, which can be, you know, for the consoles. Those should be released. I think the timeline is set to maybe mid-year or something like that. It's on the Microsoft Store? Oh, I didn't know that. But yeah, I played it on Steam. I, I, I didn't even know that it was in the Microsoft Store. Okay. Shut the hell up! People start talking about the potato aim. Okay, look at that. You can see the sky city between the trees. Right there, you see? This is the new main facility of the Zombie Research Initiative, the sky city. Massive build. Massive. Okay, I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna drink one of this. I don't have any beer. Now that I have the... Um, I read the book that allows me not to get blurry vision with the beers. Uh, I'm gonna start chugging beer because the, the benefits. This is embarrassing. Your actions bring shame to the entirety of the zombie research initiative, you embarrassing monster. Oh, shut up, Gladys. What do you mean you're going to deduct it from my pay, the cost of the well, you know what? We're going to talk about that. I still don't understand why do we have an accounting department. Yeah, that's my place over there. We're gonna see it. We're in the middle of the woods, so we can't really see it, but don't worry. There it is in the sky, you see? That's why it's called the Sky City. Callum says, yeah, there's literally no reason to. On the Microsoft Store, you have a harder time getting much to work connection to people's games and cost more. Yeah. No, I recommend Steam. Brandon says, speaking of Bambi, did anyone see a preview of a movie that's potentially coming out? Yeah, yeah, it's like a Bambi horror movie. Since all of the properties start going in the in public domain. You know, yeah, there's there's a Bam like a Bambi slasher thing coming. There it is, you see? The Sky City. Let me just jump over here so you can see. The Sky City standing like a shining beacon. The last hope for humanity in the zombie apocalypse. My senses have picked up something. Okay, I'm trying to be epic and you come over here and messing with me. We done? Thank you. There it is. You see the sky city. You can see the control tower, the sensor array, uh, the cafeteria, infirmary, crafting. Uh, like the deployment room down there. This is the, from the guys from the Advanced Propulsion Project where they were testing the engine that we're using to build the vessel that's going to the moon. Yes, it is awesome. That's the Sky City. Stands over 100 meters above the zombie apocalypse. And sun, the sun is coming up. You filter yourself. Awesome, awesome. 
remember that this is a family show, so it's good. It's good. Anybody can watch this. That's why I said it is awesome. You start the ground defenses out, JC. Remember, you have incursions. Not yet. Not yet. Been a lot of work on the lunar vessel. Because just a, sum, a summary for everybody watching. The earthquakes we've been having. And, um, you know, we've traced it to a gravimetric anomaly coming from the moon. Also, at some point, we detected a dimensional event. Working theory right now is that something is on the moon, on the far side of the moon, causing this gravitational anomaly. And we need to do something. Yes, there's been some earthquakes. You know, luckily, no one, n n not there's, we, we haven't had any earthquakes during the stream. But we've experienced tectonic activity since we arrived in this reality. Isaac says, nuke the moon. No, we're going to go to the moon and we're going to see what's going on. I have a feeling we might be dealing with anti-zombie research initiative. You know, because this is, this is like right up the rally. Reality by says, bro, I'm in on this. Awesome. Because that's the story for this session. I mean, this season. Alpha... Uh, 21. Okay. We made it back. Okay, we're going to... First... Drop the little loot that will survive. And then we will see what happens. Maybe take a gyro, you know, spin around. Okay, Siri. Great what to you see you, Master. Give me everything. I'm gonna sort it out. So yeah, this is the Element Zero reactor. Over here, we're building the vessel that's going to go to the moon. As you can see, the propulsion area, it's already built. We got this crane. And... Uh, over here, we got the area where the guys from the Advanced Propulsion Project tested the engine. There's a control tower up there. Infirmary over here. And finally, the workshop. Reality Bias says, bro, you're an artist. I'm <laughs> building my friends or something else. Thank you. Appreciate it. We like building. This is my Legos, you know? Okay, I'm gonna have to craft... Uh, an engine of destruction because it you know got blown up yeah my core i blew it up i don't know it's, let's not get stuck in semantics you know that is that is important you're a builder on arc i've read about arc Survival and Survival Evolve and... With the, I, I even have it, but I've never actually played it, you know? Let me put this over here. Let me gather the... the ammo. And a little bit more of that. And just in case any zombie shenanigans ensue. Okay, clothes and armor. Let's just put this over there, there, there. We're good. Hope they're not really attempting to destabilize the tectonic plates. We don't need a massive planetary disaster again. Things are going so well for the ZRI lately. Yeah, well, if my, com my if my suspicions are correct, remember the guys from the anti-zombie research initiative vowed to destroy us last time we fought them. So I don't know. But it kind of fits, you know. This is this is exactly like the kind of thing they would try. They suck. Okay, see you later, uh, Bill. No, there's no Mystery Zombie Theater 3000 tonight. There will be next weekend. Be on the lookout for the announcement of the schedule and what movie are we going to to watch. Uh, 
Okay. Barely by it says it's cool if it's a no. It's if a no, it's a no what? Ark Survival Ascended. Do you mind if I mention the channel? Oh, okay, okay. Sorry, I didn't read. No, you can... You can just uh, mention it. Don't worry. In fact, remember that we have a Discord. And people can join the Discord. And there's a section to post the... You know, post the... Your own videos in the Discord. Okay, so you see that's Reality Bytes channel, real videos. If you get some, you want some content for uh, uh, Ark, um, Ark Survival Ascended, you can go there and you can watch it. Okay, let's just go over here. Oh, I like for people to watch videos of, you know, builds and stuff. It is good. It is good. Okay, so we get this. We get the food. Okay, we're almost done. We're almost done here. Siri, you're it going to be to serve. you're going to be holding on to this next time we go to the trader. Ready by says, "What's the Discord, JC? If you type exclamation mark Discord or you look in the description of the video, there should be the link to the uh, invite. Also, if you type exclamation mark time." It should work now to my proper time because we moved the thing. Have you changed the schedule of the game? No, it's just that these two weeks have been very, you know, a lot of work and stuff. It, this is usually still on Friday. But as I said, keep an eye on the on the schedule for the weekend for last minute changes. Okay, and finally one victory lap around the, the new main base of the zombie research initiative the sky city you see this is the best and last hope for humanity it's a good discord yes you get the nerdy things also, all of the movies we watch on mystery zombie theater 3000 are archived on the discord all previous 67 versions if someone wants to you know like watch something you're waiting the clock on discord nice okay the time command is not working this sucks yeah there's no mystery zombie theater 3000 this weekend which is the show where we watch movies um uh, but there will be next weekend also i'm kind of shiny just no damn this yeah it will be next weekend and um and yeah uh, i still don't know what this is that we're going to watch but anybody wants to watch the previous 67 sessions they are all archived on the discord okay yeah the gyro is awesome yeah, stream elements is not working the, the time command. Yeah, Greg. I have to check out what's going on because it should have worked with EDT. Oh, no. Let's just park it down here. There you go. Okay, so yeah. That was an eventful stream, but, you know, it's good content. I'm going to get on of craft, uh, to craft another engine of destruction. Because it, it kind of blew up. No, you're not going to deduct it from my pay. Also, I don't get paid. What the hell? Why do I have an accounting department? You know, whatever. Okay, so, yeah. We're going to put this over here. And remember, yesterday we played a little bit. I have not updated the thing, so let me just see. Maybe I did. Oh, yeah. No, no, this is from two weeks ago. Um, oh, yeah, good good to have you back, Reality Bites. 
We yesterday we had the Pacific Drive video. Now we had the seven days to die stream, and tomorrow the flipping continues in House Flipper 2. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this stream. That's it for now. See you next time.